over in Las Olas, Fort Lauderdale. And today I'm taking you guys on a little kind of different episode adventure to show you behind the scenes at Industrious Las Olas, where I've been recording this podcast from. And I just want to show you guys a little bit, show you around because I never really understood Fort Lauderdale before moving here. And this is a very particular area called Las Olas. And there are so many new developments that are coming to Fort Lauderdale. And I think that some of these major companies like Industrious moving into this spot, because it's quite new, really says a lot about what is here and what's coming here. So I'm not going to take you guys all around Las Olas, but I do want to show you the space and it's new. Let's go. This cool building, How beautiful. Hey. You want to be my video? You don't have to be. This is it, you guys. Where did that come from? Just another nice person and industrious. It's Courtney. Courtney, it's your first day. Yes, yes. Welcome Indeed. slash I'm. I'm. I'll be here. I don't work here, but thank you. I mean, I just get to hang out with you guys every now and then, and you know the fun part. So I'm gonna I'm gonna show everyone around today and show everyone where I've been filming from. Yeah, they are. Check this out. Ooh. I mean, this light at this hour. Check it out. I mean, and then if you guys really want to be upset that you're not here, check out these views. Oh, there's me in the reflection. But check out that pool. What the heck? It's Las Olas, you guys. If you didn't know, now you know. Don't sleep on Fort Lauderdale. So you guys may or may not have ever been in an industrious space. This one's quite new and is both gorgeous, but also really, really functional. So they have all of these amazing rooms. Of course, you have tenants in some. We're not going to show you guys into people's offices, but this is what this is what we're working with. And I usually just pop into either an empty conference room or I'm sorry, empty office or one of these beautiful conference rooms. Hey guys, there's me again in the reflection. And there's just a million spaces always struggling to choose between all of the amazing spaces. And they just have these cute like art and plants, phone booths. Let's pop into one of these and have a conversation. I wanted to share with you guys today a little bit more about, you know, this, not just this space, which is incredible. I'm going to show you guys around a little bit more some of the things that they have that make it just pleasant to be here. I've worked with Industrious for so many years, hosting events in so many of their different spaces around the country, and they're just very easy to work with. Always great people who just want to make your experience easy and nice and pleasant and make you feel part of the community so i always appreciate that but i also wanted to just bring you shed some light if you will on this fort lauderdale area because there are something like 50 new developments in the pipeline for fort lauderdale um i think we're expected to, with those developments to bring something like twenty thousand new residents to this area i think people really sleep on fort lauderdale when they think of south florida but I now having lived here for the last couple of years, um, I see, I see it happening in front of me and companies like Industrious being here, building here, you have a, a farm to table restaurant downstairs that just opened a chain from New York city. That's great. Maybe we'll go grab a juice, um, downstairs on our way out, but it really speaks to what's coming here. And while it was never my first choice, I really didn't understand Fort Lauderdale. I thought it was you know, spring break, everybody's like right out of college, wants to party and there's plenty of that. But there's also a lot of great community here. There, it's a city. I mean, you have a lot here. So it is not a sleepy little town that's only here for, you know, Airbnbs and hotels for spring break. There's young professionals, there's families, there's businesses, and there's an incredible amount of new building going on here everything from a man a double a mixed use development from heinz right over in flag flagler village where my favorite coffee shop is i pass it all the time it's amazing what they're building over there to uh, aimco building over here uh to naftali group i mean and we're not just talking about residential buildings which there are and many many incredible residential buildings but mixed use office that means there's business here, you guys. So I just wanted to share when I started filming this 
recording this podcast this space was just opening up this this uh las alas industrial space and they are filling up quickly and you cannot imagine just how many friends and colleagues i've made or just interesting people like-minded people just met in the bathroom or just like oh we both reached for the coffee at the same time so i think that's really what the essence of coming to a physical space should mean these days is having those organic connections meeting people in real life that maybe that you didn't expect to meet having interesting conversations about products that somebody's building hearing somebody be so passionate about something you never like thought you would be learning about or had any connection to but you opened your eyes and you're like wow this you know i see i see why that person is really into it and like good for them you know that's really cool how can i support them and then they feel the same about you somebody overhears me talking to you know one of these really interesting guests that i have and they're like what do you do what kind of conversation was that you know i think about that all the time and you're like oh i just guess i just made a new friend so um i've really enjoyed being here i'm gonna continue to enjoy being here and i just wanted to share with you guys because every episode that I've recorded of this Healthy by Disrupsiary podcast. I'm sitting in a new corner of the industrious Las Olas space. I think one episode I, I was in the uh, industrious West Palm Beach space, which is beautiful and incredible, has beautiful views of the intercoastal. And, you know, you can see a lot of development happening around that space as well. West Palm Beach, another incredible emerging market, um, has been for a long time, but uh, truly remarkable what has been developed there mostly by related um but it's very cool so it's very cool to watch this all i wanted to share with you guys a little behind the scenes let's go check out like the snacks and the water and all the amenities wellness uh corner let's go so you have a little kitchen stuff like this so you can make your lunch coffee the most important part of a soil occlusion and uh they have this great product let me see if i can show you guys so they have some teas, but they also have this incredible product that is a decaf coffee with a Swiss water processed decaf, which if you guys know or don't know, coffee is decaffeinated using formaldehyde and other chemicals. So that Swiss water process is really, really important. And I'm so impressed that they have that. Some sodas. They have this incredible bevy machine. If ever any of you guys have been to a Disrupsiary conference, you probably remember cocktail hour with bevy drinks. Incredible. So you can see, like, if somebody's in there, this is just a quiet space. This is just a space where you can be quiet. When everybody's laughing and having a great time, that's me. Hello. And we can just, we can just relax in here. We can take a load off. And this is a great spot to just kick your feet up and take a breath, take a minute. But this is, this space is actually equipped with what you need. It's like a mother who might be lactating. They have things like milk storage bags. Incredible. Wipes, breast milk removal soap, stuff I don't really know about, but you know, a little refrigerator, the fact that they have created it and they are making it something that's important tells you a lot about where you are. It makes you feel like you don't have to go home every, you know, minute that you need to do something private. You don't need to walk out of the building or walk out of the space to have just like a moment to yourself or just to breathe for a second. Also, I have to mention that they just have the best coffee table books. I mean, they're just, they're everywhere and they just always have the best stuff. Who curates these things? So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed my behind the scenes and more to come. We're going to be recording episodes every single week right here from Industrious Las Olas. So I hope you guys, if you haven't joined us yet on the Healthy by Disrupsiary podcast, I hope you take the opportunity to start watching or listening this week. Um, this podcast is all about how Buildings and spaces can really support the health, the well-being of the people that are in spaces, whether they work in spaces, live in spaces, learn in spaces, shop in spaces, as well as the communities around them. And I think community is at the heart of what healthy means to me and to many of my guests on this show. So I hope you guys, for those of you who are listening, are really enjoying. And for those of you who are just tuning in, there's plenty more to come.